Hey guys, so today I am going to be doing a plan with me video. This is my happy planner. I'll be doing it in and I am using the planner girl um, kit with the add-on boxes. There we go from Fab Planner Print. So I will just get on and do this. So the washi I picked is these two because I thought they go brilliantly with the um, the colours in this kit. So I will start with the top washi first. So I hope you would all have all oh, you all had a lovely weekend. Today is Sunday for me. I'm um, actually being brave and actually doing this while my children are upstairs and I am actually told them that I'm doing a video so if you hear them calling or anything it's fine but they're watching YouTube at the moment so normally that keeps them quiet for a little bit so I find that they watch YouTube a lot lately though it's like I try and tell them you can watch YouTube all the time but you know is on every single device as well so they don't watch it on their ipods or their iphones but they watch it on their xboxes or their playstations and it's like seriously they're not for watching youtube they're for playing games on but instead no they watch it on their devices instead of playing games that's why when it was sunny i absolutely loved having the swimming pool out because they were off their devices because it is hard to get them off their devices. They never want to go out. They never want to do anything. And with school holidays coming up, I'm like, oh, we need to think of stuff to do. And it is hard um, because my eldest now, Michael, he breaks up Wednesday. So his last day in school is Wednesday. Then the other two break up on Friday. But when you've got an 11-year-old, a 12-year-old and an 8-year-old, finding things that they all enjoy together... It's really difficult. They they don't always agree on stuff. It's like Owen wants to go and see Cars 3, but the other two don't. And it's like, oh. I know they all want to go and see Spider-Man, so that's one good thing. And we went to see Despicable Me 3 last week. Oh, so good, guys. You really need to go and see it if you haven't. It's probably the best out of the three films. I love the Minions. And I thought it was absolutely fantastic. And the music, because obviously I was born in the 80s, but I absolutely love 80s music. And the music in there is, and the comedy is quite witty film, which I love. Right, so um, I'm babbling away. Let's get the boxes done. So I don't think I have anything on tomorrow. So I'll put, actually, I want to go to the works tomorrow. Well, I'm hoping to be able to go to the works tomorrow. There we go. Put that box there. And then... Um, Tuesday, Michael got a school trip. He is off to a theme park. So I'm a bit nervous about that. Does anyone else get nervous when their kids go to like a theme park or... You know, he's got to be dropped off at high school at half past seven in the morning and then he comes home at half past six. But, like, I'm absolutely petrified. <laughs> I get so anxious and nervous. I suppose because they're your kids, you always do. But it just terrifies me, you know. When we take them to, um, like, the fair and whatever, I'm always like, oh, you can't go on that ride or you can't go on this ride. But because I'm not there, he's going to go on every single ride possible. And he ain't going to care, is he? He's just going to be like, ha, my mum ain't here to stop me. Actually, I'll put that at the bottom there because then I'll put the bottom washy. But Saturday, we have a date night. Well, I say date night. I won tickets to the Speedway. And so, obviously, if you class loud motorbikes with no brakes in a stadium a date night, then... <laughs> But yeah, no, I won tickets, so I'm super excited about that. We love the Speedway. I've won tickets. This is my third year now I've won tickets to go to the Speedway. And um, we've won passes to go into the pit lane before the actual um, races start. So look at this sticker, guys, with the pens. That is absolutely gorgeous. I will put that on Thursday. So... 
anyone have any ideas what I can do with the kids during six weeks holidays because that is so expensive like we don't we don't have the money to go on holiday we can't afford to go on holiday this year um but it's just so expensive doing anything like for the cinemas it's even expensive but I do like going to the cinemas there's nothing better than going to the cinemas with the kids they really enjoy it and the Odeon do the best cheese sauce with your nachos ever that's my favorite part I think um I like to use all my boxes. Mm. Put that on Saturday night, I think. But. Mm. Yeah, so as I was saying, um that's gone on Saturday. I do normally put um my checklist boxes. Um, whatever I want them but I'm going to start putting them at the bottom now even though like obviously various things are done at various times but I prefer them at the bottom now so let's just put them there so Saturday now the grandparents will come down and have the kids so then my in-laws they'll have the kids for us for a few hours um, I don't know whether we're going to have food after the Speedway because the food in the stadium is really expensive to buy. I think it's like something like five, four or five pounds just for a pasty or something, which is ridiculous. And it's, you know, it's not even like a huge pasty. <laughs> You'd expect a ginormous pasty for that much. And the drinks are expensive as well. Obviously, um, we don't drink alcohol. We um have coca-cola or pepsi whatever they have but um yeah that's expensive as well but obviously you need to take a drink because security they don't allow you to take drinks into the stadium um and when we went to see justin bieber in the same stadium you, you see the security was you know they upped their security so much obviously because of what had happened in manchester but um they had scanners where they um had to scan you they searched your bag and then they had these metal detector scanners and you had to put your arms out and you know they scanned you all over to just double check which I think I'd rather be stood there waiting that extra bit longer for that extra bit of security than you know them just lay you all rush in at once so I hope they do that for the speedway but like I said I, I don't know what I'm going to do with the kids for the six weeks holidays you can't take them, like bowling, there's only so much bowling that they want to do. They get bored after a while of bowling. There's only so much, you know, they can cope with until they get bored. And it's like Michael now, he's at the age where he wants to go out and do his own thing, which I don't mind, but I still like to do like things as a family. But I like this. A goal without a plan is just a wish. It's cute. So, oh, what am I doing? There we go, that one first. I want to keep the July there because obviously it's actually all the same colours, so it's not too bad. It's quite pretty. And then we'll put that there. I just can't believe it's six weeks holidays already. And like Courtney starts high school now, September. I just, I'm baffled. Like, where's time gone? And then I love all these little paper clips here now. Um, the stack of books. I just read a good book. Um, there's a YouTuber called Sprinkle of Glitter. And I've watched her for years now. And she got a book out, Wild Like Me. And it was absolutely fantastic. I was a bit apprehensive because I thought maybe you know because some of these youtubers they do rush out books and you know but it was I bought it on the Thursday the day it came out I didn't start it till Thursday night I'd finished it by the Sunday morning the week it come out you know so it took me a couple of days and it was absolutely fantastic I could not put it down it was brilliant um if you like people like Sophie Kinsella and things like that, oh, it was absolutely fantastic. A real page turner. But I absolutely loved it. 
I don't read a lot of books. Like, I give them up to the third chapter, and if by the third chapter the book hasn't gripped me, then that's it. I put the book away. I won't read it again. Like, um, Girl on a Train. I've seen the film, but the book, I just could not get into the book. I don't know what it was. I just couldn't get into it. So I didn't bother finishing that. Me Before You. Oh, absolute. The film is okay. But nowhere near as good as the book. The book is absolutely amazing. I actually cried reading that book. Sad, I know, but I did. I cried reading that book. Really, like, such a lovely... Oh, no. Look what I've gone and done. See? This is what happens when I talk. I've gone and placed all these down and not put my washi down. <sighs> See? This is what happens when I talk. <laughs> I end up getting carried away talking. Um... Maybe just put a little bit of washi in there then. I get so distracted when I talk. Right, crisis averted. Um, <laughs> I'm luckily Tony stickers. Um, they come up really well, so I've just pulled the stickers up and put the washi down before I forgot. This is what I mean, guys. When I when I babble on and talk, I completely, absolutely forget what I'm doing. I even forget what I'm talking about sometimes. So, which is, it's not, it's not good. It's absolutely not good. I get like that sometimes. I'm like midway talking to my husband and I'll forget what I'm about to say. And he's like, what was you going to say? I'm like, I genuinely can't remember now. It couldn't have been that important if I forgot what I was going to tell you. Um, actually, I'm going to use these. I love these little paper clips here. I'll use these by here and have them as like, like, you know, people have dots and things as your checklists or your things to do. I'm going to put them by there and have them as like my points of what I want to do this week or what's got to happen this week. So, um... I'll put another pen. I like the pens. Absolutely love the pens. As I was saying before, anyway, I rudely realised that I'd forgotten my washi tape. Is that I love me before you. Any other books that I can read that anyone recommends? Because now I've finished Wild Like Me, I need a new book. A new book that I want to read. Um, I love the Twilight books. Oh, huge Twilight fan here. Not that I should be omitting it, I don't think. Um, I might put the Starbucks down. I've never had a Starbucks coffee in my life, but I've seen the McDonald's like iced frappuccino thingy majiggies that I want to try. So I might just put that down at the bottom there, like that. Sorry if you can hear the kids. They've just decided that they're gonna build a den, and obviously building a den requires moving the bedrooms around <laughs> clearly so but i don't mind as long as they're not fighting because they tend to fight a lot which is not good they argue over the silliest things as well like who can watch youtube because obviously they're at that age now where not only do they agree on not wanting to go places together but they don't agree on what to watch together either so that's my plan I spread so far. Um, I don't know if this video is too long now. Uh, I want to put some functional stickers in. Uh, I'll use some of these stickers Michelle sent me because you've got bits of gold speckle and I'm sure that there's a date night sticker. No? No, there's not a date night sticker, but we've got washing machines and that. So obviously, washing on a Monday. It's Sunday today and I'm doing washing today, washing sun, uh, tomorrow. It's never ending washing with these kids. I probably have to do washing Wednesday as well. I'll put that up there, actually. Um, bins, the black bag, the black bin, should I say, and the recycling Thursday, so I'll put them to there. I love my functional stickers. They're so cute. Um, what else do we have? Hmm. We 
got another washing machine because I do more washing than Friday. I haven't got nothing. I don't think I've got anything to say like, yay, last day of school or anything like that. I got emoji stickers. I'll use an emoji face sticker. Um, emoji face sticker. Maybe that one. Michael's last day is Wednesday though. So I'll put that in for Courtney and Owen. And then I'll put this one in for Michael. Because he finishes Wednesday. But he finishes early Wednesday. So, but I'll write everything in after this video guys. Because I don't want to bore you for too long but this is my planner spread so far i hope you like it and i hope you have a lovely weekend and if you have any suggestions of what we can do in the six weeks holidays or any books to read let me know in the comments bye guys